Hi, how you guys? Yes, I have on a t-shirt. It says strong is the new beautiful. Strong is the new beautiful. That's right. All right, all right, all right. Thank you for joining me here at Audrey's Reading Area. I have another article from a magazine that I will be reading to you. Yes, a real life hero. A real life hero taken from this Scholastic Action Magazine. Yes, this I thought this was a very good article. A real life hero. Let's see what it says. Let's do this. So it says, her name is Serenia Shriskal, uh, I said this right before. Shrisakul, Serenia Shrisakul, is a fire lieutenant in New York City. We talked about her, we talked to her about her dangerous but important job. This is written by Anna Stercheski. Serenia Shrisakul was in a fire engine, sirens blaring. She had been called to an explosion. Most of the firefighters on the truck thought it would be a false alarm. They get a lot of those. But when they arrived, Serenia saw a horrible scene. A building was starting to collapse. The people were crawling out, hurt and afraid. If you had seen it, you would have probably run in the other direction. And you should have. But Serenia's job was to go into the burning building. She's one of thousands of firefighters in the fire department of New York City, FDNY. We talked to her about her important job. And this is her. Serenia. You were the first Asian American woman firefighter in New York City. What was that like? It was hard. I had to really prove myself. Everyone was waiting to see how I would do. You help other women become firefighters. Why is that important? Only about 1% of people in the FDNY are women. And it's hard when there aren't other women around. You might get let, left out of things or not be taken seriously by your male coworkers. I want to help other women succeed. The FDNY needs them. Fire Department of New York. Why does the FDNY need women? I want the FDNY to look as diverse as New York City does. There should be men, women, and people from different races and cultures. It's important because we respond to all kinds of situations, not just fires. We get called to help when someone is hurt. If that person sees a firefighter who looks like them, they might feel more comfortable. How does someone become a firefighter in New York City? There are lots of tests. A written test, a physical test, a medical test. And then you have to go to the fire academy. Mm. All in all, it takes about two to four years to become a firefighter. Wow, I didn't even know that. What's the best part of your job? I love that every day is different. I could never work in an office doing the same thing every day. I love the excitement of getting a call and going to help people. And it's fun to drive the fire engine and have everyone get out of your way. Wow. Wasn't that nice? The end. The end. And so there's like a mini skills workout, which I'm going to read to you guys. It says, what to do? Write your answers on the lines below. So you can write, you have your own paper out and you can write, answer these questions. The author says the fire engine sirens were blaring. What do you think that word means? Write it down. Number two, question number two. What's one reason Serenia says it's important for the FDNY to be diverse? Can you guys think of it? Write it down. And when you want to find the answers, just rewind this video so you can find the answers. All right, all right, all right. Question number three. 
find a sentence in which Serenia explains why it can be tough to be a female fighter without other women around. Write it. Write it down on your paper. All right, all right, all right. For the answers, if you don't already know them, just go and rewind this video, replay it, watch it, answer these questions. Some good questions. All right, all right, all right. Thank you guys so much for being here with me here at Audrey's Reading Area. Wow, I love reading these fun and exciting books to you guys. Thank you, thank you, thank you for smashing that subscribe button. Smash that subscribe button. All right, all right, all right. And don't forget to share all my videos with everybody too. I'll see you soon, you guys, here at Audrey's Reading Area.